And the disciples came to him and said, why do you speak to them in parables? And Jesus answered them and said, to you, it has been granted to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. Matthew uses the phrase kingdom of heaven as opposed to the kingdom of God that's used in Luke and also uh, in Mark. But it says, but to them, it has not been granted. For whoever has to him more shall be given, and he will have an abundance. But whoever does not have, even what he has shall be taken away from him. Therefore, I speak to them in parables, because while seeing, they do not see. And while hearing, they do not hear, nor do they understand. In their case, the prophecy of Isaiah is being fulfilled, which says you will keep on hearing, but will not understand. You will keep on seeing, but will not perceive. For the heart of this people has become dull. With their ears they scarcely hear, and they have closed their eyes. Otherwise they would see with their eyes, hear with their ears, and understand with their heart, and return, and I would heal them. But blessed are your eyes, because they see, and your ears, because they hear. For truly I say to you that many prophets and righteous men desired to see what you see and did not see it and to hear what you hear and did not hear it. Now, this particular passage here, again, in Matthew 13, is right after the parable of the sower. And in this chapter of Matthew 13 and also in chapter uh, 4 of Mark, we are learning about the mysteries of the kingdom of God. And Next week, and we'll talk about this shortly, but next week, next Sunday, we're going to dive into the teaching or to the parable of the wheat and the tares. And the parable of the wheat and the tares is specifically about the mystery of the kingdom of of God. And so it's a parable that's about it. And so today what we're doing is we're laying the foundation for this mystery. We're going to describe what the mystery is. Because the mystery was given and handed to the apostles. And Jesus says, you can receive the mysteries. It's been granted to you to receive the mystery of the kingdom of God. But it's not granted to those outside. Those outside must hear parables. But you will get the explanations of the parables. So the disciples receive, the apostles have, they are stewards of the mystery of the kingdom of God.